a food champion is a lovely, ordinary, normal person from local communities all around Preston who is passionate about food and health and would love to share that passion um, you know, with their local community, uh, inspire people to, to do some cooking, to enjoy it, uh, to enjoy eating and to raise awareness around healthy eating options and all the wonderfully exciting food projects that are going on in Preston at the moment. This phase of the project is a pilot so it's an eight-week programme where we're training people to be able to go out into the communities. We're then going to be asking them to come back to us with um, information about what else they might need to be, to be able to do the work that they see that needs to be done. They're going to be working with people that have picked up information um, from the newspapers and TV and internet that is uh, a bit sketchy on you know whether it's correct or not and they're going to have to deal with trying to get a consistent correct message out there. So it's just getting out there and spreading the message that like foods can be a medicine and it can be healthy for them but it also can have massive um, effects on the health. The interest in doing this course was perhaps to help other people with a variety of, of health issues. It's not just arthritis that can help. Obviously, it can reduce uh, you know, a risk of diabetes, heart disease, um, a multitude of, of health issues that, that hopefully good nutrition could really do something about. What they're doing is perfect because they help people understand about um, healthy food, how to cook from scratch, um, what to avoid, and more um, focused around health and how to eat healthily. Um, that works really well with the project that I'm working on for the asylum seekers um, because these people haven't been used to English food and they are quite novice at um, understanding how to read labels and things like that so they don't know what the healthiest food options are. Um, they can also help teach them how to cook um, and use different ingredients that they might never have seen um, and I think that they'll be really useful. Um, to integrate the community as it's a community group as well. The next phase of the project is a cafe in Preston. It's going to be hopefully in the city centre. High Street uh, would, be, would be ideal. It will be a place where people can come and they'll be able to get a coffee or a bowl of soup. Uh, they don't need any money if they haven't got any. Um, it will be a place where people can get signposted to other services and we'll also be doing training there.